Hi and welcome back to the photographycourse.net YouTube channel. In this video I'm going to teach you how to install the Lightroom presets and brushes that you've downloaded from our website. I'll be doing this on my Windows PC and using Lightroom version 11.2. On the photographycourse.net website you'll be able to find lots of cool Lightroom presets and brushes to download. No matter what style of photography you're into, you'll be able to make good use of these when post-processing your pictures. It's very easy and using presets and brushes makes a workflow that is very straightforward and creative even when you're not used to using Lightroom. So we're going to check out the portrait presets today so you can find that and click on it and then once you're into that you'll get some details of what the preset's all about and different styles that it'll create. You can choose the before and after slider thingy there to get a preview of how these presets work so that you'll be able to get a pretty good idea if they'll suit your style of photography or not. So you can browse as many of those as you like and then once you're ready to make your choice you can then click on the button to add that to the cart and go through, through the usual checkout process to make your purchase. So once you've downloaded it you need to open Lightroom and go to file and then import develop profiles and presets. So then go to the file that you've just downloaded and once you've located that you can click it and click import and the file Lightroom will import the files for you. This will import the Lightroom presets and it may or may not import the brushes. When I've tried with Lightroom 11.2, the new version where the brushes function a little bit differently, then I had to work through a different series of steps that I'll teach you now. So getting the brushes to function properly you need to be in the develop module and then go to edit and then down to preferences and click on that and you'll get a dialog box opening up that you need to go to presets and then show all other Lightroom presets and this will take you through to your folder structure click on Lightroom open that folder so double click on that and then scroll down to where you can see local adjustment presets and then you'll see the brushes there and you can open that and once you're done go back click OK close Lightroom and then reopen it and once Lightroom started again you can then navigate back to the develop module and then click over on the mask icon and select brush and so once you've got the brush there you can go to where it says effect it'll probably say custom and then that dialog box will open up and give you all of the new brushes that you have just imported so these are lots of different styles so depending on the pack that you've bought they'll be different but these are the portrait brushes and I'll just show you a little demonstration here of the black and white one. So it's just a matter of clicking on it, choosing the size of brush, and then painting it over the area in your image that you want to have the brush effect. And now this one, I've chosen the black and white one. So I'm making him look black and white, basically desaturating the color out of him and uh, making a nice monotone image there very, very easily. And so the best way to uh, really learn what the brushes do is to pick a few images and work through the selection of brushes that you've just downloaded and have a lot of fun with them, make the most of them and choose some that are your favourite. Some will suit you better than others for the style of your photography. So you can just really play around with those and experiment with how they work now we'll go back over to the presets and show you a bit more detail about how they work. And again, you can see just scrolling through the list of the presets that is on the left hand side. If you don't see this list, click on the little triangle at the side of the screen or press F7 key on the keyboard. And you can scroll through those and see what kind of effect they have 
on the image without committing to it yet and then once you've chosen it you can click on the style that you like the preset that you prefer that gives you the look you like but even if it's not quite how you like it you can use the basic panel or any of the other modules on the right hand side and tweak that preset until you get the look that you like and this is a really cool way to learn how to use Lightroom because it gives you a leg up, it gets you started and then you can work from that foundation to develop the style of photography and the style of post-processing your photography that you really enjoy the most. So I hope you found this helpful, I hope that this will give you a good start to using presets and brushes. Thanks for watching, I hope you've enjoyed the video and learned something. If you have, give us a thumbs up and also if you're new to our channel, click on the subscribe button and check that bell icon so you can stay up to date with any new releases that we upload.